Welcome everybody back to Let's Play Little Dragoon Call Her With You. This is Plays brought to you by MuchGames.ca. In the last video, of course, the Divine Dragon attacked the Town of Dragon. the. Drakengar. Deningrad. Why well, I said Drakengar for, but. anyway. And this is actually a retake of this video, part 67. Why? Because of the fact that. My laptop crashed when the initial video was completed. Am I happy about that? No. Of course, there's not much I can do to control that, neither. So, I am a bit pissed off about it, but... Again. I mean, what am I gonna do? I literally stopped the video and... I didn't get the blue... Well, you could probably see kind of a blue screen of death scenario happen, but what ended up actually happening was it said that the game itself actually, uh, or the laptop itself, went and crashed. So, kind of a different blue screen of death for Windows 8, I guess. Definitely interesting. Anyway, menacing. Oh! One thing I know for status ailments is that this. That if you go Dragoon, the status ailments actually be cured. Now, I did get rid of a lot, a lot of my items I feel would be useless for some battles and everything, so. The monster was heading in the direction of Deningrad and then came back to the Mountain of Mortal Dragon. The father of the Dragon Dragon left. Did anyone pass through here? No, sir. No one, sir. We didn't even let a mouse pass, sir. Unless they can fly like that uh, monster. Gotcha. Stand guard here. We are off to defeat the monster. Yes, ma'am. Good luck. Yes, gonna need it. I'm not gonna get what's into that chest just yet, even though I've been itchy to get out for since disc 3 began. I'll get on the way back. I'm sure I can do that. Okay, so... Ah! What do we have here? And yeah, as I said before, this is part 67. And this LP will be my longest. Guaranteed. Part 78 was the last part of Bowser's Inside Story, and, well... Yeah, dude. We gotta do that. We're just gonna take it down now. I even have a good strategy you now to head up, heading against. The uh, Divine Dragon, when I hit that guy. When I hit that boss, so. Wow, three of us couldn't even take out one wound bear. Now, if this hits does ailments on everybody, no, just one. Okay, well. Actually, in the initial video, it hit on two. It hit Dart and Congo. However, I do know now that you can actually get rid of that status name by going Dragoon. Not only that, but Dragoon actually. You don't even get any other status ailments, come to think of it. So, yeah, so the next battle I gets into. Congo's going Dragoon. And a phone rings. Call its phone. Who the hell kind of a number is that? Anyway, what the hell is this? What is. Uh, looks like it sliced open. It seems he just died. Does this mean there's was somebody else in here beside us? Let me say besides us. Anyway, Lloyd is the only one I can think of. What Lloyd be doing that for? So it's two dead dragons here. So would Lloyd be trying to take out the divine dragon by himself? Even if he was there? Hmm. Got a lot of questions to ask upon that. But before we do that, let's get into another battle. 
Right about now. Kind of going the wrong way. You can go to a chest on the right side, but it only leads to a mine purifier. I'm not really interested in that. Uh, now this is the time I want Congo. Defense is really weak right now. Oh, and here's some new enemies. We have a fire type enemy in the Mega Sea Dragon and a Deadly Spider. Yes. And I miss. Why not? Ooh, 180 damage. Okay. Here. This is going to clear off from... Yeah, we'll do this right now to clear off some other stuff. And now. Get the battle scene to change up. I haven't seen Demon's Gate. But I think I want to use Astral Drain just to heal up a little bit and everybody. Uh, yeah, I knew. Why not? I'll use everyone else to attack. And the Fearful Stat is actually cured off Kangol, so. Don't worry, I'll get the this stuff back, but I don't plan on using the magic at all for the Divine Dragon battle, as it is virtually the same kind of battle as we had against the Grand Jewel. And of course, it's never a good thing. Yeah, a little bit overkill, don't you think? Okay, so Congo. Perfect! Wow, I've never gotten this. My camera, I don't think. Yeah, you're dead. That's actually not, I've never gotten that before. Okay, that's attack. I uh, can't get perfect there, but I did try. I really just got a perfect first try of a Congo. I think it was the first try, was it? I don't know. I have to go back through their videos to check it out. Don't really want to do that, though. Okay, so we got two new attack items, both gushing magmas. Uh, you know, I think I'm happy with what I got, though. I don't want to overbear myself with too many attack items, because I know I'm going to need other items beside. If we go to the other side, there is a chest there, but it contains a mind purifier, so I don't really want that. I do want the chest on top, however, because I think that will help me out a lot. With whatever will be in that. And there's a chest below that I definitely want. Because what's in that chest below... And how the hell do I know that was going to happen? There are two other sets of enemies in here too, by the way. Actually, three others. One I didn't even come across. I did come across these guys. These guys are known as baby dragons. Or... Yeah, baby dragons. So, Rose, you're going to attack this one. You. Now, I don't know what other attacks they have. Because I never really had the honor of attacking them. Like that before. And usually Dart just takes one out by himself anyway, so... There we go. And I guess it'll probably be Rose and Dart doing this one. But one enemy I haven't taken out is Wyvern. They are here. Oh, I got him, but I actually failed to push the button? Or did I push it beforehand? I don't know. Anyway, it's dead, so... Why not? For this time we get two mind purifiers, which... I don't want. What we'd like is to actually complete this episode and not have my laptop crash. Okay. Can't carry any more items, but I do believe that like, last time I had a healing breeze in this, so I am gonna discard one. Hmm. 
Actually, I could use one, though. I want to use the healing rain because this is what we call full HP for all. Okay. Yeah, it does have healing breeze, so... All I did is just replace one. There are two attack items, well, arrow items, that I am going to need, especially for defensively, and one, and the other. And I am going to use them for specific characters, too. i come down here first. Now, I don't know this from my initial recording. Oh yeah, I, but of course, you know, we gotta get into another battle first. Heaven forbid. Oh, it's just these guys again. Yeah. Why would you want fire? I can give you all death. See? Now, wouldn't that be suited better for you? Well, that kind of didn't help there, but... 216 damage on Rose! Man. I know Rose is... Good, strong character... Well, okay, I may not fail on that one, but I already got Chris Dance maxed out. So, as you can tell, I'm not really worried. Okay, so moving on. I think we lost this before, but Tardock shares over 30,000 experience. Which is a good thing. Okay, in this chest right here, we have an item that would be great. Giganto armor. For Congo. It's, well, he's the only one that can actually use it. Not only is this great... Look, it actually increases his night shield. What the hell did I uh, take off him first? Stunger, no. Well, I actually, I don't even know what I took off him. But anyway, the Giganto armor is going to be your big thing. I, oh, Stun Guard, I think I had on. Um, um. Anyway, what I'm thinking of it... No, I don't want the additions. Uh, let me go back to armor for a second. Hashul, I'm going to actually take something off of you right now. I'll put the Night Shield on you so I can put the Attack Badge on Kongo. Why? Because of health reasons. He's actually the second strongest character in terms of HP. And if I plan it out right against the Divine Dragon, because he is he does have a strong attack power, then this should actually help me defeat the Divine Dragon quicker. That's my logic. Of course, there's the only way I play the game. Everyone else has their own way of playing the game. Don't worry. So, we get into another battle here, surprise, surprise. What have we got? Actually, yeah, there's going... Oh, these are new enemies. The Air Dragons, and what are they called again? BC Dragons. They look like teenage baby dragons. It's like, yeah. Teenage Mutant Baby Dragons. Doesn't really make sense with the song. Ever. And now let's see his attack power. 1241 against them is not bad, actually. How did that last one not connect? I don't know. Rose is not going to be able to defeat him. Rose is going to be able to defeat him, okay. Well then, prove me wrong. I can have it, Rose. You're supposed to. Well, okay. You can prove me wrong. For now. Okay, so. This chest right here. Bottom chest down the lower right there. I didn't open because it contains something I don't want. The dragon helm, I do want. 
And I'm actually gonna put her in dirt. Here's why. Dragon Helm. Raise maximum HP 50%. Look at the defense. And the magic attack. So now he has a HP of 2580. Which means that I can actually heal him up big time when needed. The hell is that noise? Yeah. Oh god, is that lasers? Okay, what the hell is that thing firing out? It is from the top of the Mountain of Mortal Dragon. That was a magic power. An awfully powerful mega magic. Uh, oh, there's a third one. Does that come from the Divine Dragon? Whatever it is, that is our destination. Uh, yeah, as if... It is unburdening his anger all over the world. The anger towards the Winglies who sealed him. And those Steelmans who dominated the dragons? Then, does this mean that Denigrad was chosen to be the place for the declaration of war? Maybe. We all settled that on top of the mountain of Mortal Dragon. Before the next town becomes a victim. Yeah, that's a good idea. It's like, yay! So walk in. Hey, you just must have fired off another shot. Man, that must be one powerful dragon to do that. The fact that we gotta take this thing on is not gonna be scary to me. Oh! Can't carry any more items, can we? Actually, that's only a vanishing one, so... Why would I go after it? I don't know. I'm gonna use a healing breeze. This will recover HP for all. I'm also going to replace Rose. You've had your time with... Albert. And... Open up this chest just for the hell of it. A total vanishing. So I think what I'm going to do is save, stop the video here, and in the next video we will actually... Here, that's what I'm going to save too, over that one. In the next video we'll actually go up there, take on the mortal dragon. This is Cole signing out. Peace out everybody.